Paulus nih. गुजरात मराठा द्राविड़ उत्कल बंगा 
विंध्य हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्छल जलधि तरंगा शुभ नामे जागे तव शुभ आशीष मागे गाए तव जय गाथा जन गण मंगल दायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे भारत माता की जय मातरम मातरम
but because of the wisdom of all our predecessors and uh, you know we we reached to a point where we launched satellites and you know we uh, we have aspirations and we are also emerging global superpower. But all that has happened because people have come together to you know to with a sense of purpose to work towards nation building. To all the young people, to all the young students over here, I would appeal to you that uh, you must develop a sense of purpose. There has got to be a larger purpose than just you know doing your routine job or you know doing something just for yourself or for your immediate family. Uh, you you can contribute in your own way. But once you develop that larger purpose, you can achieve great things. As far as the university is concerned, uh, uh, we are on a trajectory of growth. Uh, the last two three years were challenging times with COVID and all the challenges that were not only put on us but on the entire on the entire globe in a sense the world came to a halt. But I'm really happy with the way everyone has bounced back to the university and around the globe. So it's a great uh, testimony to the spirit and the willpower of humanity at large. Uh, solutions came about and we successfully, you know, I would say tackled the, the pandemic which is uh, which was upon us. So I think the next the next decade or so is going to be something that's going to be exciting for all of us. Uh, we hope that uh, this university can truly become a center of learning which is uh, acknowledged not only in this country but around the world. The path is not going to be easy. Uh, nothing is built overnight. Uh, if you look at the great universities of the world, they have a history of more than 100, 200 years, 300 years. And they reach where they are because of the continuous effort of the founders and all the you know subsequent uh, leaders over generations and decades and centuries. But I think as a young university, I would call a university young because uh, it was uh, these institutions were founded by my father, uh, Dada, who I you know who's the very reason why we all have assembled over here. He's been my inspiration and my living God. So it's got deep roots. It's uh, it's vibrant. Uh, uh, we face challenges, but uh, we, you know we've always been anchored very strongly to the ground. But I'm quite sure that in the future we'll have great things in store for all of us over here. Once again, my best wishes to all the students, all the faculty members, uh, to all the cadets. It's absolutely fantastic to see you all in this beautiful, you know, wonderful colors. Uh, the national flag fluttering. It's an amazing sight when I was driving and all the way from Wally to Melon you know, you could see that forward and you know uh, everyone. I recollect such a similar emotion uh, when he ran on the World Cup in uh, nineteen eighty three and of course two thousand eleven and you know everyone streamed out on the roads with flags waving in their cars and horns blaring. So uh, it's wonderful to, to see that spirit. And I think uh, with the collective effort of all of us, we have a, a glorious future of all of us. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir, for it, as always. A happy 76th Independence Day to all of us. It is indeed a proud privilege to be a part of the Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav, an initiative of the Government of India to commemorate 75 years of independence of our other land and to celebrate the splendid history of this country, of its people and their achievements. Azad so, is the elixir energy of The nation of progressing towards fulfillment of its dreams, its dreams of good governance, its dreams of its of harmony amongst its citizens, its dreams of development. Today, as we celebrate the 76th Independence Day, let us pledge to precious freedom of mind and body, the faith in our words and the pride in our souls to be there. Let's pledge 
freedom which is truly free responsibility to contribute to the glorious history of our beloved motherland on this note may i now request honorary colonel professor dr james thomas with the vote of thanks our president and chancellor honorary dr vijay patil president of this court is uh, shivani patil ma'am Um, our chan vice chancellor of kamaya our former vice chancellor of the series party the deans heads of departments professors and all the faculty and the students and my ncc cadets who have done such a wonderful job in the last one year we are grateful this morning to be having a good weather that we were worried in the morning when heavy rain in satikri this up to function so thank god for this it is my privilege to uh, thank our uh, president and chancellor of the vijay party on this occasion for the words of wisdom that he has given us that we have over the last few weeks and months we are grateful for the progress the university has made in the uh, in its academic activities in infrastructure developments in the outreach programs in the uh, collaboration with international things it is a leadership which has helped us to have the university go for and we hope that we will achieve more may come in the dreams with the cross for the university we need to reach that the right in the coming weeks and i hope our president's leadership will continue to be so we thank you now mrs vijay shivani party for her presence and for her being there whenever we have certain functions and also for the leadership that he has given we are grateful to our vice chancellor dr kamaya who has just joined us He has a large experience in Manipal University with uh, infrastructure development, finance, and other areas, and we hope this this uh, present will increase our uh, university stand. We are grateful to Dr. Shivaji Sh Sh for for his presence and for for having served here for for many years. He is one of the senior hosts in the faculty. He serves as the vice chancellor. We thank him for that. All the deeds and the rest of the department. So, Good morning, morning, good evening, sir. Good morning, good evening, sir. For the students, we thank you for all. And our cadets, my dear cadets, who have done a good job, they are trained. So NCC is the largest uh, youth organization. And we are happy that we have a youth NCC. We got units here from the last few years, and we have done a good job in the leadership of the NCC. We thank you once again for your presence, and uh, we wish you a very happy celebrated Independence Day.